The following video is sponsored by InstantMaddenCoins.com. The only place to get Madden Coins instantly on every console and platform is InstantMaddenCoins.com. Use code CLICKWID at checkout for a 10% discount. Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again with another Madden mobile video and guys today What we're gonna be taking a look at is a ton of new content that entered into the game late last night into this morning We've got some new playoff stuff. It's very very exciting stuff if you're into the Madden mobile content I mean definitely a huge influx of new elite players Possibly the biggest influx that we've seen since the beginning of the game I'm trying to remember but I think it is I mean we've got 55 new elite players that have been added into the game They're all 89 or higher overall so that's definitely a nice thing um, we are also going to get 12 playoff sets so that's good with 12 playoff heroes as well um, live playoff events all kinds of different cool stuff uh, showdown events as well that are based on live in-game performances from wildcard weekend so that's definitely cool um, there are also still the career tributes of steve smith and robert mathis in packs as well until um the 9th of january so that's nice and then we here are the actual playoff packs guys 200,000 coins each so they are certainly not cheap but you do guarantee yourself an elite playoff player that's in, like i said an 89 or higher overall so that's definitely cool um, and then there are also five gold or better players in there as well So I actually do think that given the fact that we're getting this 55 uh, New elite players. I do think that we're gonna start to see a little bit higher pull rates on those elite players That's just my theory, but I think that that's a good possibility of happening. So that's definitely a good thing as well um, There are also legends still as well. Um, we've got the Frank Gore which is uh, a set and then there's also the uh, Terrell Suggs that you can actually still get out of packs So that's definitely a good thing as well So there's a ton of stuff that we could potentially pull today guys. We are gonna go in here Let's take a quick look at these sets the playoff sets. Um, we've got all kinds of different ones here LeGarrette Blunt, Marcus Peters Mike Mitchell um, I mean like there are a ton of really really good players in here like oh because those are the NFC ones I guess there's a uh, AFC or AFC and then here are the NFC ones as well um, Zach Martin gets one okay, but you know offensive line in, Mo er, in uh, Madden Mobile Yeah, it's not really uh, the most important DeAndre Levy. I can't believe that they put him in there I mean like he's a good player, but like I don't know man Like <laughs> it seems kind of weird It seems like there's a lot of other players on that team that should be uh, in there as the uh, as the elite But uh, you do get the Eli Manning here the Jimmy Graham. So that's nice um, to always get those big physical tight ends. Obviously, I think the one that people are most excited for, um, obviously, we've got the Marcus Peters there, the LeGarrette Blunt. But al although there is a good LeGarrette Blunt that I'm currently using on my team, uh, but this Vic Beasley, I think, is a very, very nice card. I'm pretty excited. I want to try and get that. 95 overall as a defensive end. That, that would be pretty nice. So... Uh, anyway, guys, and then uh, one other thing that I did want to point out here before I go in, I'm going to open up a couple of these playoff packs as well. Um, I did want to show you guys as well that the Ultimate Free sets are going to be coming out of the game fairly soon. Um, it looks like we've got about two days, 17 hours left at the time of me recording this. So let's see here. Uh, I guess that would be on the 10th. It'll probably be out of packs. So just make sure, guys, that if you're interested in actually doing these sets, that you get them completed in time. So uh, let's go in here, guys. Let's open up some packs here. We, Like I said, we do have the uh, playoff packs. We can only open up two of them, but I will be doing that for you guys so we can see what's actually in them. Um, there are also bundles as well that do guarantee you a couple of other playoff players as well. Um, so let's see here. It contains four NFL playoff packs and a topper of five legend items. So, you know, nothing uh, super spectacular there as far as those go, in my opinion. But, uh, you know, decent enough anyway. And then, uh, obviously, we've still got the standard pro packs here. So let's start off with a little pro pack action. See if we get an elite out of these. And not going to happen on the first pack, okay? One more. We'll try one more pro pack. And then we'll uh, rip the playoff packs. See if we get anything good out of those. No elite. We get a Deshaun Jackson there. But, all right. Let's open up these playoff packs. Like I said, we've got two of them. It's going to be a total of 400,000 coins for these packs. But screw it, man. Sometimes you got to be great. Sometimes you just got to open up the 400,000 coins. <laughs> like, screw it, dude. Let's do it. All right. I don't even know how many uh, total cards is in this. Looks like, what, six? So, uh, yeah, that's not a lot of cards. Uh, I did tell you that. It didn't say, it didn't, like, hide it or anything. But a lot of times they throw in some other, like, random crap in there. But, all right, let's open them up here. Brandon Flowers, okay. Raheem Moore. Josh Klein. These are not good pulls so far. Taylor Lewan, 
And then we get our playoff player. It is a Cole Beasley, aka Cole Beastly. And let's see here. Let's take a look at this card. 89 speed, 70 strength, 92 agility, okay. Um, 89 elusiveness, 92 for a catching. Could be a lot worse. I mean, I don't think this thing's anything great, but still, still a decent card. I wonder what these are actually going for right now because they are so new into the game and the packs that you have to open. I mean, I guess you could probably get these out of pro packs, but like it seems like it's pretty unlikely right now given the fact that I opened up uh, one of these packs and I only got one of the players. So my guess is that these are probably pretty expensive right now. I doubt that the Cole Beasley's worth 200000 but you never know what these are actually worth. So we'll have to go in and take a look at that at some point here. But all right, we open up the one. Let's open up the other. Hopefully we get something freaking amazing. That would be great. All right, let's do this, guys. Let's open it up one more time. Justin Forsett, Morgan Moses, Shaquille Barnett, uh, Charles Clay, Will Beatty. And then here is going to be our playoff player. And it is a Justin Britt, an 89 overall freaking center in Madden Mobile, that is not a good start. <laughs> Damn it. 70 speed, 80 excel, 86 strength. 93 for a pass block is pretty good, though. I do have to say that. 84 for an impact block and 87 for a run block. So, I don't know, man. I, I don't think these are necessarily worth it. Um, like I said, we'll have to see exactly what these cards are going for right now. It might be pretty difficult to pull them in anything but the playoff uh, packs. So, in that case, they might actually be going for a decent chunk. But... That is going to do it for this video, guys. Hopefully, you enjoyed it. If you did, please do me a favor and drop a like on the video. Make sure that you subscribe to the channel if you're new. We're going to be doing a lot more Madden Mobile content here on this channel this year. So, be sure to stop on back if you enjoy Madden Mobile. And if you guys like standard Madden Ultimate Team, of course, I will continue to make that content as well. Got all kinds of different stuff planned for this year. Collabs, all that kind of stuff. So, thanks again for all the support, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Be sure to stop on back, and I will talk to you guys again soon.